and new in theaters this weekend is a biopic of the 36th president of the United States, Lyndon B. Johnson, and a movie about a group of moms going on a bit of a rampage during Christmas. Our film critic Will Loper has a preview of LBJ and a bad mom's Christmas. Convention fever grips Los Angeles. The only major threat to Kennedy's hopes is Senate Majority Leader Lyndon Johnson. Woody Harrelson stars as Lyndon B. Johnson from election. In a surprising upset, Senator John Kennedy has won the West. What? Hi, Jack. You mind if I ask you a question, Lyndon? To becoming president. A new leader has emerged. America has a southern president. You don't waste any time, do you, Lyndon? Excuse me? Rather not have it than have it this way. LBJ is rated R. There will be no compromise. This is about making President Kennedy's vision a reality. I spent months picking out the perfect present for everyone. You know the only thing I get in return? Coupons for free back rubs. That's not okay. Bad yeah. back rubs. And the bad moms are back. Christmas is supposed to be fun. Make the home. Say Christmas back. No more perfect gifts, no more perfect decorations, no more perfect anything. Mila Kunis, Kristen Bell, and Katherine Hahn are causing mayhem during the holidays. Sweetie, we don't drink the tree water. Because we're people, right? Oh, God, make it stop. A bad mom's Christmas is rated R. Where's your tree? I didn't want to waste time Christmas tree shopping. I actually just wanted to enjoy Enjoy Christmas this year. Amy, you are a mom. Moms don't enjoy, they give joy. That's how being a mom works. Uh -huh. Is Thor 4D a practical business model? Probably not, because we you know we can't perform live in every in every movie theater in America, but but perhaps they can tape um, one performance and, and stream it live. Oh, that's just a movie, isn't it? Yes, I think last time, at last check, that was yeah. just a movie. It is hard to imagine the Norse god of thunder and a big green angry man teaming up for a buddy comedy, but that's exactly what's happening this weekend at the movies. We're talking about Thor Ragnarok. It's opening here with Preview. He is our film critic, Will Loper. Good morning. Good morning. I'm really jealous of that audience. That, right. That must have been pretty oh, surreal. Man, yes. That wig and Tom Hiddleston. Amazing. Looking anyway. Good. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> 17 superhero movies later, a Hulk and a Thor, and somewhere we're at the one being called the funniest one yet. By the beard of Odin, that surprises me. <laughs> Take a look. So much has happened since I last saw you. I lost my hammer, like yesterday, so that's still pretty fresh. And then I went on a journey of self-discovery. Chris Hemsworth plays Thor, down on his luck. Hello, the goddess of death has invaded Asgard. Oh, I've missed this. That is, until he meets Jeff Goldblum. He's a fighter. Teams up with his brother, Loki. This would be such fun. And his old buddy, the Hulk. And you and I had a fight recently. Did I win? No, I won, easily. Doesn't sound right. Well, that's true. Can Thor save the universe from Kate Blanchett's excessive eyeshadow? I'm not a queen or a monster. I'm the goddess of death. Find out in Thor Ragnarok, rated PG-13. Here we go! So Danica has saved me multiple times from excessive eyeshadow. <laughs> I just thought I would point that out. I'm glad and to see the that world. I'm not, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm not well, the only one. The, yeah, legend tells that brings about the end of the universe, so... Right. Whew. Good. If I can do it, I think Thor can do it. Yeah. I'm yeah. just saying, not to spoil yeah, absolutely. alert. So <laughs> these yeah. movies have turned more from like action thrillers to flat out like laugh lines. I mean, the whole idea is now it feels like to make people laugh. Absolutely. I mean, I'm just thinking of Spider-Man Homecoming. I thought that movie was a riot. And so yeah. I'm hearing this is the uh, funniest Marvel yet. I'm like, no way. And apparently 80% of the movie was improvised. Wow. Yeah, which is crazy to think about. That's a huge amount, <laughs> holy smokes. The director was saying, Chris Hemsworth, he's one of the funniest guys he knows. He wanted to really showcase his comedic talents. And the bot, of course, too, but... Uh, <laughs> of course. Apparently, yeah, Hemsworth, I, I saw his comedic delivery in there. Felt really funny. And you said he had to bulk up, right? We yes. were just talking about how many calories a day he had to 6, consume. 6,000 calories a day he was eating to bulk up for Thor. That's commitment. So when he was last Thor, then he de-escalates his body and goes back down to like a normal... Yeah, a normal, a very human mortal, yeah. Unbelievable. Yeah.
Uh, Monday, live at four. Uh, I'll be here. All right, you're gonna watch the LBJ one too. Uh, I think I'm gonna go Bad Mom's Christmas. Nice, the <laughs> but, double comedy. Uh, I wanna, yeah, I'd like to see all three. You know, Susan's really looking forward to that <laughs> yeah, one. Yeah, so you yeah. have to give her the preview. <laughs> yes, she always <laughs> takes notes during the Bad Mom's movies. Right. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Thanks, Will. Thank you. Your time.